and we're going to loop through our gems. So i dot count or dot count i plus plus, and then we're going to loop through them again. Uh, j equals zero, j less than gems count uh, gem yeah dot count j plus plus. And if gem sub i dot is neighbor with gem sub j. So if the two gems are a neighbor, then we want to swap them and check to see if it would make a match. So we're going to go ahead and say toggle physics. So we're going to say it's off. Um, so we have our two gems. Let's go ahead and make some, call it G equals gems sub i and gem f equals gems sub j. Or f. So we need to swap their positions and we need to swap their neighbor lists. So, we need a vector of 3 temp position. And this will equal g dot transform dot position. So we can say f or g, g dot transform dot position equals f dot transform dot position. And then f dot transform dot position equals temp position. And we need a list of gems or gem temp neighbors. And this is going to equal a new list of gems with uh g dot neighbors and we want to do this before the swap I think so we're going to do this here and then we're going to add one more thing vector 3 we're going to call this f temp and we're going to call this G temp or temp and then this is going to equal f dot transform dot position and then we're going to go ahead and say this is equal to f temp this is equal to g temp And now we want to swap your neighbors. Uh, so g dot neighbors equals f dot neighbors. And f dot neighbors equals temp neighbors. Alright, so now we've swapped our gems. And now we need to check to see, or now we need to construct our match lists to see if these this swap resulted in a uh, match so we need a list of gems and this is test list gem one or test list g was new list and construct match list and we want to pass in all this stuff for g uh, color g g dot x chord g dot y chord and the test list g this is a ref okay and now we need to do something similar to fixed match list so let's go ahead and copy this 
and we're going to say this is test match list and instead of matching anything because we don't want to actually make the matches for them we just want to return true there was a match return true or we want to return false and there wasn't a match and we want to say if test match list g comma test list g if it's true then we want to reset our swap and return true there was a match